What's up guys, welcome to your 41st Python tutorial and in this tutorial I'm going to show you guys how to work with files. Now by working with files I mean just um, like opening up a text file and how to read the information from it and also how to uh, write information to a basic text file. So before I get started let me show you guys something. Um, in my hard drive I created a folder named test and in that folder I created a document called um, A and this is just a blank um, text document so uh, I just wanted to show that to you guys so because uh, this is the file I'm going to be working with so just so you guys don't get confused so let me X out of this uh, there we go and now let's get to the good stuff so in order to work with a file the first thing that we need to do is create something called a file object and this object is going to allow us to uh, perform actions on that file so I'm going to name mine FOB for file object and once you have a file object you need to set it equal to the path using the open method now the open method takes um, a couple parameters the first one is um, extremely important actually they're all extremely important but this is the path of the directory wherever your file is that you're going to be working with and if you remember mine was in test and it was called a dot text uh, I named it something short because I wanted to be able to do this and didn't take a long time the next um, parameter it takes and the last one I'm going to be teaching in this tutorial is something called the mode now this is an empty file and we want to be able to write text to it first of all so I'm going to put W in here if there was text already in there and you just wanted to read it you would press R but since it's empty we're going to write something to it first so now when we press enter our file object was created and now we can do stuff to that file so the first thing we want to be able to is be able to write information into the file so go ahead and use your file object and remember whenever you use this it refers to this file right here so it says alright what do you want to do to this text file well we want to write to it and write is a built in function and write takes um, one parameter what do you want to write to it let's just write hey now brown cow and then when we press enter it's going to write to that file now since we're done with the file you should always close your files when you're done with it so put um, fob close and go ahead and press enter and this closes the file now we have the text hey now brown cow in that file so let's go ahead and uh... where is it computer hard drive test a as you can see that empty file now has hey now brown cow with brown misspelled just like we did so that is how you write text into a file using a file object to open it now say we already have a file that has text in it like we just made what happens if all we want to do is read from that file well of course we need to go again and create a file object but this time we want to create something that we can read from we can't use fob because this only writes to it but we want to be able to read from it so let's um, make file object and once you create it again it's going to be all new a totally new object so let's open and this is going to look very familiar in I don't know why I just did that don't do that open and in the parameters the first one is the directory just like before test a dot text and your next parameter instead of W is actually R since we're gonna wanna only read from it this time now once you have your uh, file object in case you didn't figure out you can go ahead and use the read function to read from your file now the read function actually takes parameters believe it or not and the parameters it takes is how many bytes do you want to read and a byte is the same thing as a character whether it be a number or a letter so let's go ahead and read the first three characters of this file which includes hey now brown cow press enter and it says hey since it's one two three I gave you guys the first three bytes and this takes parameters because sometimes you don't want to read an entire file if it's like huge or something but let's say you did want to read an entire file and this is even easier than before what you would do is press read 
built in function and put no parameters at all. When you don't have anything in your parameters, it means, all right, read the rest of the file. So go ahead and press enter and it says, now brown cow. And this is because, because you already read the first three bytes. So from that point, it just reads the rest of it. If you uh, wanted to read it from the beginning, you just would put nothing instead of three in here and it would do that. So again, to recap one more time, when you want to work with a file, you first need to create a file object and you need to set it op equal to open the directory and what you want to do to that file. And once you have that, you can either read or write. If you want to write, you use the write function and then close. And if you want to read, you use the read function with the parameters how many bytes or leave it empty if you want to read the whole file. And of course, we should close this too. Just for uh, just to be safe. So that's your quick tutorial on how to work with files, um, open them, read them, and write text to them. And don't forget to close your files at the end to prevent memory leaks and stuff like that. So um, that's your quick tutorial. In the next tutorial, I'm going to be showing you guys more stuff on uh, dealing with files and stuff. And hopefully it will clear a lot of this stuff up. So thank you guys for watching. Uh, practice opening, reading, and writing files. And I will see you next tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe. See you.